All right, so we're here at Miss Ellen, Mrs. Ellen Hewitt's home. I'm um, going to be mulching and cleaning up these beds over here. So we need to make sure we spray all these weeds. We've got a lot of weeds in here uh, that need to be sprayed ahead of time. But we're going to be mulching under this area. Um, mulching all of this. Nice good old layer of mulch throughout. And we got a lot of bare soil. Um, we're going to be keeping those plants, keeping those, uh, the ground cover right there. And then there's some hostas back in here that we are keeping. So do not spray those or remove those. Uh, but just about all the other ground cover weeds over here, they're going to come out. Um, so we have some liriope in here. We got one, two, three, four. So just try to try the best. I mean, we got some hostas and stuff like those, but then we have some pieces of grass, like spray what you can in here, get it all cleaned up best we can. Um, and then just do a, a nice coat of mulch over this whole thing. Uh, I got like a daffodil right there. We have two beds down here. We got one on this side and we got one on this side. You need to just clean those up, mulch them. This side seems to have a lot of hostas, so, you know, just mulch around those guys. And then um, we're going to continue up through here, up the side of the house, um, keeping all these plants. There's a nice little fern there. Make sure you mulch around that. I uh, got hostas coming through here. Try to just mulch around those. More hostas. Um, they're pretty resilient, so if you cover them with mulch, they should come up. Um, some grass and weeds and stuff along this edge needs to be sprayed. A lot of stuff under this azalea, um, like those taller grasses right there. So all that needs to be sprayed. And then mulched under. Make sure we spray the stuff behind the foundation over there. Um, more grasses. We've got a few liriope in here. Try to spray around these liriope as best we can. We've got a bunch of daffodils in here. Um, we've got hostas back there. I would just kind of leave that be. And then over here. So we got a bunch of Liriope right through here. I would just mulch thick over that. It'll come through. Make sure we blow the leaves out. Then we got grass under here. All this needs to be sprayed. Those leaves need to be blown out. Blow the leaves out to the woods over there just to get it out of here. But yeah, so more uh, spraying right through here. Gonna be mulching. And then mulch from this area, this whole corner, just to make it a little easier for her to mow. Mulch over this whole corner right here. All the way basically up to the gravel and then we're going under the shrubs right through here spray that put some mulch in there i'd spray under this tree as well throw some mulch in there i'm walking around throw a little bit of mulch under this area after those weeds are sprayed and then we're going back up towards the other area. We are not mulching this. This is only going to get sprayed. I'm not mulching this. Just spraying. This up here is going to get mulched. A lot of other plants in here. Probably not too much to spray. Um, probably more of them. Just a mulching situation. There's a few weeds in here. Um, but yeah. So mulching this. Mulching the hedge. Coming down. Going around the side of the house and then around the back. We've got the island in the back. The two on two islands on either side of the patio down there. Got the bed right here. We're just spraying that, and we have this island. And that'll be it.